Analytical chemistry covers the fundamentals of experimental and analytical methods and the role of chemistry around us. It studies and uses instruments and methods used to separate, identify, and quantify matter. Basically, it is the science of obtaining, processing, and communicating information about the composition of structure of matter. Objectives of Analytical Chemistry To develop an understanding of the range and uses of analytical methods in chemistry. Establish an appreciation of the role of chemistry in quantitative analysis. To develop an understanding of the broad role of the chemist in measurement and problem solving for analytical task. To provide an understanding of chemical methods employed for elemental and compound analysis. To provide experience in some scientific methods employed in analytical chemistry. To develop some understanding of the professional and safety responsibilities residing in working on chemical analysis. Benefits of Analytical Chemistry Analytical chemistry has played critical roles in the understanding of basic science to a variety of practical applications, such as biomedical applications, environmental monitoring, quality control of industrial manufacturing, forensic science, and many more fields. Number 1. In medical field, it plays most critical role in the drug development process. It serves as the backbone to framework the drug discovery and bolstering the growth of the pharmaceutical industry. In our environment, Chemists are developing tools and techniques to make sure that we can see and measure air and water pollution. Example is, in gravimetric method of analysis, we can measure the amount of chemicals that is only in potable range. Number 3. In manufacturing, especially in chemical industries, complex of processes, operations, and organizations engaged in the manufacture of chemicals and their derivatives. And of course, this is not made possible without analytical chemistry. In forensic science, analytical chemistry is useful to interpret the effects and quantify the concentrations of the chemicals present in biological specimens to provide reliable data. Hair, nails, urine, blood, and brain tissue are useful biological specimens for forensic toxicologists to draw interpretations of various cases. Analytical chemistry covers the fundamentals of experimental and analytical methods plus the role of chemistry around us. It studies and uses instruments and methods used to separate, identify, and quantify matter. Basically, it's a science of obtaining, processing, and communicating information about the composition and structure of matter. Plus, it teaches us specific ideas to the application of science in daily life. In biological research studies, Analytical chemistry drives out the systematic way of processing and utilizing the tools available for data sampling. Analytical chemistry will always be a significant importance towards every place in society, whether it be a CEO of a big company or just an average citizen. Analytical chemistry will always be important to society's everyday life. As an aspiring researcher focusing on the field of anything that involves terrestrial ecology, 
getting a good grasp on the key points foundation of analytical chemistry will help me with my day-to-day -day life as well as with my future goals, especially on how ecology is studied in which it studies the interaction of organisms with their physical environment. With this, I am capable of studying not just the interaction of organisms alone, but with the chemicals, compounds, and substances that are also interacting with them and with the environment. And to get a better information on what substances are safe for this location and what is not. And to have a better monitoring on the environment on the lookout for dangerous contaminants that may harm the environment. Hi, this is Auntie Zaini Vino, just a second year student from BS Biology. So I pursued this course because during my high school years, I was a researcher. So here are some of my studies from before. And when I was still a student researcher, I went to different laboratories. So first, I went to Department of Science and Technology in Butuan, Parawi State University, IIT, and also in UP Diliman. So I have observed that in these laboratories, most of the staff are chemists, and they are also the ones assisting in our studies. So while I was taking the course, which is analytical chemistry, I realized that the methods we are applying from before are under this one as we deal with crude leaf extraction that is under the classical methods and we also run phytochemical tests to know the compounds present in our specimen. So basically, our research and analytical chemistry will never go far with each other as they have a very pure connection. So it is through analytical chemistry that we know the chemicals present in our specimens and it is also through plant biology research that we know why this exists and its indications. So I hope you also enjoy and appreciate analytical chemistry right now because it is applied in many aspects that we just don't notice. So that would be all. Thank you! The scope of analytical chemistry is very broad and it touches every aspect of our lives. It is important to study analytical chemistry because through this we can analyze and investigate man-made products which undergo a lot of tests and must be FDA approved before it could be introduced to the economy. Moreover, with the help of analytical chemistry, we can determine the environmental contaminants around us. Through this also, we can identify what is the origin of the substance and how it is formed. Through new ideas, we can create new inventions. Understanding the composition of a matter would help us gain information about their origin or how they are formed. It provides us data of the existing materials or substances. Therefore, analytical chemistry is an important field of study.